what is up welcome back to my channel you guys we're still here in quarantine in cali how are you guys doing so far let me know in the comments down below so i decided to do a what's in my bag and kind of like chit chat to get to know each other um i noticed that when i started my youtube channel i didn't really give you much information of myself but i'm also like just want to let you guys know what's up with this channel to start off with so hi my name is jules and i love makeup i'm a makeup junkie i love collecting makeup i love skincare i love dyeing my hair um during this process we ended up gaining some weight which we got to work out which i'm not a big fan of the only thing i really do love to do is swim and play tennis those are like my top two that i like push it hard to do um yeah i am old enough to drink i don't want to give my age because i i mean age is an age you know it just depends on how you feel in the inside um i am hispanic i am a mixed baby but let me know in the comments below you guys how long have you guys been watching me or if you guys have any questions regarding me so i could do like a q and a um yeah let's get started with this video i, I don't know i'm really like nervous not up to it kind of still like getting the hang of these videos and i know i've been doing a lot of videos so um yeah so this is my bag it is non-branded i actually got this one at target okay so let's go ahead and get started for starters, I do have a ring light in my bag because I do take pictures here and there when I'm out. I don't really carry it. I actually just recently found it, so I started charging it, and now that I'm now that it's charged, I use it here and there. Next in my bag, I do have a sanitizer. This is actually from the uh, I think this is from Bath and Body Works. I thought it was so cute because it was like kind of like mermaidish vibe, but honestly, it sucks at like spraying it. It's really hard, so. Because of that, I do have another hand sanitizer, and this one I ended up buying it from Target, and then I have another one, and this one's from Bath and Body Works, because I always lose them or I forget them or I leave them anywhere else. Um, then we have mascara from Tarte. Actually, like this is actually like one of my favorite brands when it comes to mascara. That one and the L'Oreal as well. Next in my bag, I do have this uh lip gloss which is actually one of my favorite ones i finally was able to get, to get it back which i need to buy another one just in case this one is for play from artist couture i love this one it's like you could wear it without a lip color or with a lip color it still looks freaking nice then i do have some wipes you guys you guys need to have these just in case um i actually like this brand a lot because it's more on the earthy side then this one, but this one's an antibacterial one, so that's why I carry both of them depending on what am I doing or where am I at. I have both of them just in case. Moving on, I have another hand sanitizer. This was actually supposed to be my car. So, yeah. Then we have my favorite nude lipstick, which is the Jeffree Star in the color Daddy. I love this one as well as the one that they came out with. Um, I don't remember the other name. But it's another one. But I really do love this one. I love that it's kind of like on a more cool tone side than a warm tone. Then in my bag I also have this one. Which I wanted to try out um, tanning. Because I haven't been tanning at all. I'm really, I feel like if you guys see my videos back then I was a little bit more darker. And now I'm like way light. So I kind of want to go ahead and tan. But let me know in the comments below you guys. Which is your drugstore tanning that you use or any just any basically tan? I kind of want to do a comparison of like which one's better or not. But let me know in the comments below if you guys tan, which is the one that you use. Then I also have a feminine hygiene wipe. You guys, you need to carry one of these just in case. Like if you get on your period or just in case. Usually I carry these especially when I'm on my glory days because you never know when it comes or just like randomly pops up. Especially if you're irregular or the fact that you've been using BC. So this. Then I also have this Listerine one, which I actually do not like. I like the little packages, which is this one right over here. So I carry both just in case. Um, I ran out of this one, then I have this one as a backup. But yeah, I don't really like the spray for some reason. I feel like this one's more efficient than this one. My personal opinion. Um, there's still a lot more in here. Great. Then I do have a hand cream, which is the Ultra Repair from First Aid. We have another lip gloss, and this one's actually from 
Ulta and it's their infused lip oil and this one is in the Sweet Rose which I really do love this one. This is when I started getting into lip gloss. I mean I wasn't ever into lip gloss. I'm always a matte and now it's like I'm into lip gloss. Like I need lip gloss in my life. That's another story. Then I have my AirPods because just in case, just in case, I have a menstrual pad because ladies, you'd never know when some other lady may need him or when you're on him, you know, or just it pops up. You know, you need to have a menstrual pad just in case. You can have a smaller one or a larger one, but just in case, have one. Then I do have various SD cards in my bag because... Um, a lot of my SD cards don't really work, so I need to figure out how to make them work on my camera. My camera is being really picky right now, and I can only use a Samsung entrance, so that's what's going on right now. And once I remove the SD card and put it in my laptop and edit it, and I put it back in the camera for some reason, it does not read it anymore. So I have to go ahead and delete it and reformat it and do a lot of other stuff, which is kind of like annoying. Oh, here's another SD card. I have some change. I have 22 cents. You guys, I mostly use Apple Pay because mostly everything has it, so cards aren't really something that I have. I also do carry makeup remover wipes in my bag because you just never know when you stay over or you're tired or you just need to remove something. You just never know. Then I do have a Target receipt because I love Target. A scrunchie. Another two more scrunchies. Okay, two more scrunchies, another SD card, another SD card, oh my goodness, then my ring because I take them off when I don't have nails, so I take off my rings here and there a lot. Then I do have another mascara, a pin, and this is another receipt from where? From, ooh, oh this is 85 Cafe because I got sea salt coffee, they're so good. Then, let's see what else is in the pockets. Oh, my card. My my card, just, just in case. And that's it. That's pretty much everything I carry on my bag. Um, nothing really important, I guess. It's mostly just like hand sanitizer, wipes, and makeup, and ponytails, and a crap load of SD cards. Alright, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video on what's in my bag. I don't really have anything exciting I want to say. Let me know in the comments down below, you guys. What is something that you need to carry in your bag? Comment down below. Let me know. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, you guys. We have already hit 1,000 subscribers. Let's get it up to 1,500 subscribers. Don't forget to share this video as well. Alrighty, guys. I'll see you in my next one.